Hello everyone and welcome to the demonstration of Eval OMR software. This is the first part of a four part video series. We begin by step one, how to design OMR sheet. This video explains how to use an existing template for an OMR sheet or create a new one for an MCQ exam. In the Eval software, to design any type of OMR sheet, you need to just click on the configure button and then click on templates. You will see there are many predefined templates available in the software like basic 100, basic 125, basic 150, basic 30, etc. You can use any of them. Most of our clients do not need to create a new template. But if you want, you can easily create your own template using a blank small grid. For that, just click on the blank small grid template and then click on modify button at the right hand side. After you click on modify, the software will automatically redirect you to the Microsoft Excel based OMR designer, which is inbuilt in the software. To insert the logo, select the area and click on the merge button. Then click on insert logo at the right side. Select the logo file in your system, click open, the logo will be inserted in your file. For inserting the institute name, you can select the area and then merge cells. You can insert any image if you have or simply type the name and adjust the font size. Um, here we're going to adjust the font size. For inserting the OMR field, let's say roll number field, select the grid box and click on create field button on right. You can see here, a dialog box will appear asking details. Mention the field name, which is unique. Let's say we put roll number. Set the field type here. Here we will set select numeric. Now select the field size, let's say six, then field title that will appear on the OMR sheet. Here we will put roll number. Click create. Now the roll number OMR field will be created for six digit roll number. Similarly, let's create for student name. Here field type will be alpha and field size let's say 18, title being student name. Um, you can see the name OMR field being created here. You can see that. You can select and you know do your normal editing. Now we'll create for date of birth. For this, the field value will be date format. The format will be standard and title would be date of birth. Um, let's click on create. You can see that the field is created here. And you can do your editing. You can shift it where you want. And edit the title just like normally you would do in an Excel or a Word format. For creation of questions, just go to the Create Questions button. Another dialog box will appear. Here, starting at means question number, which is 1. Number of questions in the MCQ, say 10. Question type, let's say MCQ. Number of choices can be 4. Um, choice type could be A, B, C, D or 1, 2, 3. Oh, we'll see. Let's choose A, B, C, D. Question spacing 0. And MCQ questions will be then created successfully as you can see here. If we want to create integer type questions, then choose type as integer. Number of digits say 1. And then click on create. And you can see we have integer type questions with us. 
Mm, now, if suppose we want matrix type questions, having sub questions, we can create that too. Let's say number of questions two, sub questions would be, um, number of questions two, sub questions would be four, and the type would be matrix. And each having number of choice, say five. So you can see we can create. The next type of question that we have is numeric type question, which is majorly used in IIT J exams as well. So in this question type, we have the options to choose the numeric values in decimal. So we can easily choose uh, digits before decimal or even after decimal and then just create the question. Um, now to save this template, just click on save template as button and provide a name for example new OMR. Save the file, the template will be saved successfully. Now close it. You will see that the tem template will be available under templates section. You can view the PDF of your templates by clicking on view PDF at the right hand side. The template will appear and will be ready for printing as you can see here. Good thing is it can be printed on a normal A4 size 70 to 80 GSM thickness paper. So there will be no need for a thick paper or any special ink to print this OMR sheet. So this would be your step one. Thank you so much.